time is it for me? It's 2.15 a.m. So if this is all good and dandy, I'm going to say load most recent save. Load games manually. It wants to send me there, but I know I want to go to this save state, so. Now if everything's working fine and dandy, that'll be fantastico. I'm actually enjoying the game a lot so far from the bits I played, but of course I take a little break for stuttering to fix in there. We had it mostly fixed there, but maybe restarting the game will make it worse or better. It mostly looks like it's better, which is good. Okay, well back to playing then. Let's go. In the box, we have a lockpick and we have all the pre-order stuff and the ID stuff and etc. etc. I think I'd already done everything around here except to appreciate these dirty socks one more time, which really stink. All right, then to go after I see I got the lockpick from there. You unlock it. Then the phone rings, which I'm gonna go pick up. Hi, phone. You did good, Ethan. Zoe, right? And what the fuck are you? Shut up and listen if you want to stay alive. You gotta get out of that house. There might be a way out through the main hall. All right. Oh, and that thing on your wrist is a codex. Don't lose it. It's important. Magnifico. Okay. Hell of a girl. Yeah, hell of a girl there, Mr. Ethan. Let's kick through here and. Do I want to open this? Ah, healing items are always appreciated. Sure, I'll open it. But what if there might be other things to open with my lockpick? Maybe I shouldn't open the first thing I see. But I just did, so you know, whatever. Yeah, I've obtained it! Let's go a little bit more this way. And now, I go over here. I thought a guy was going to start knocking, but I guess not. Well, how strangely mysterious. Let's go back. Oh, there open it is. Up. Hey! Hey, you. hey, over here! I'm coming over there, sir. How's it hanging? Hey, you! Hey, you gotta help me. Hold on, back up. Now, sir, do you live here? I mean, is this your property? What? Me? No. No! All right. Now, we got several calls about some missing persons late. You don't understand. I gotta get out of here. Now, calm down. You're not listening to me. There are crazy people in this house trying to fucking kill me! <laughs> well, all right. Let me tell you this. You don't exactly seem like you're playing with a full deck yourself, all right? Are you kidding me? Look, like I said, we've had several missing persons called. And I can't rule out that an outsider like yourself may not be involved. All right. I'll tell you whatever you want. All right. Now, that's more like it. Now, meet me in the garage. We'll talk there. Hey, wait. You gotta give me your gun. <laughs> you must have lost your mind. Look, officer. Hey, deputy. Right. Deputy. Now, do you want to see my name in the obituaries? Or do you want to be a hero and save my life? A fucking pocket knife? Here. Take it. That's all you're going to get. Now go. Garage. Now. What am I going to do with a knife? Obviously never played a Resident Evil game again there, Mr. Ethan. <coughs> Knives can be surprisingly effective. Now before I go and open up the garage over there, I'm going to do some exploring and get these Mr. Everywheres in the boxes that have been eluding me now got my magical knife. He's here, he's there, he's everywhere, said a Mr. Everywhere. Let's go over here then. Similarly, there is another Mr. Everywhere right over this way. And that's already two for two. Two for two. Now, 
let's go straight into this. Was there any other boxes I need to destroy? No, no, there's just the one box. I would have noticed other boxes because they look destroyable. Was there any downstairs? There is actually one other area that could have been, which I might have not seen immediately. Which would have been inside the save room. Save room, oh save room, were you hiding boxes from me? They were hiding TTVs. Laundry detergent. And a duck here. Interesting. Sounds like something's in one of these. That's fine. All right, I think we can go inside the garage now. You guys ready for a little misadventure, I guess is the term I'm gonna use for this one. Hang and ammo obtained. Here's this. Let's open this up. And there's a button. Ta-da! Garage is open. Officer, what's happening? Let's go check him out. Hey, we gotta get the fuck out of here. Now first you need to tell me what you're doing out here alone in the middle of the night. Me? What about you? No, it's my job. Why don't you do your job and tell me? Answer my questions. You're not gonna believe me if I told you. Try. Hey, put that door open. Put Wait. that door open. Wait! Wait. Uh. Oh boy. Well, let's get this. Oh, hi! Jack seems very excited. Oh, dude, you're right there. He's really on top of me in all this. All right, let's let's get a little bit of knifing practice in. Oh, he destroyed the box. What a rude fella. Really doesn't like it. Where the hell you think you're going to, son? Uh, need the key. Okay then. I was about to heal. You're part of the family now. Well, I'm happy to be part of your family. Oh, he backhanded me. I'm gonna go back over here for a second. Let me look around a little bit. Oh, oh, there he is. I was like, where'd he go? Oh, am I dead? I am dead. He was very hard on me. Retry. I want to experiment. I don't want to waste my ammo. <laughs> it's knife, obviously. Oh. Dark keys. Really doesn't like that car very much. Is that this a car? Old Actually, man, son, you can't take on an old man. Hi. That was fun. There goes my window. Missing. Oh, oh, I think I figured out where he went. Oh, shit. <laughs> Struggling with him here. Let's 
finish this, you and I. Oh, oh yeah, I'm gonna take you for a ride. No, 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 no! no! Oh, oh, that was close, just by a little bit. Oh boy. He looks fine. Oh, he just blinked. Well, that's nice. Should I close the door? Oh. Oh. Oh, boy. Now look what you've done, motherfucker. This isn't the end, you know? Fucking up, up. Oh. Well, that could have gone worse or better. Oh, hey, they can live together how they died together. He looks fine. Oh boy. Car has been broken down. Now I'm actually curious about something. Do I have your attention, boy? You're about to see some more. Oh. Fuck! Well, if you want to do that, Jackie, you could have just asked. I like looking into my brains. <clears throat> Now, I actually want to redo that boss fight, even though it was a pretty good run. I know it's kind of a weird thing, like, oh, Ryan, you didn't just beat the boss? Oh, there's more back up there. But I want to test something. I like testing boss fights. That was a fun boss fight. I, was, I actually had a good time with it. I want to test something with that boss fight. I've got, I've got a mighty fine suspicion. I want to see if I can do the old knife run I've always dreamed of. <laughs> Now I meant to do. Fuck you! I'm gonna kill this. Want to fight like this? I'm ready to fight like this. Let's go, Jack. He can go fast when he wants to. There's another item thing I before, I know I'm that. I'm gonna squash you like a bug. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, 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 now I should heal. Uh, of course. Is he trying to tell us shut up? Oh, he impaled me. Peekaboo? Problem is, knifing him seems like it's different. I'm an old man, son. You kill me, and I just right on back. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. I got myself a little bit. I think I put a lot of items away. Let me get this over here. Oh. That tickles, boy. Oh, he got me. Should have walked against that. Come at me, Jack. I'm trying to block so that didn't work out. That's tough. <laughs> what? Oh. Oh. Oh boy! Oh 
Oh boy. Got you. Oh boy. Let's knife it. We got this. Oh boy, well we beat him! Knife only! I was trying to watch the game, that works out well. Oh, he's, he's still fine. Oh boy! Now look what you've done, motherfucker! <laughs> this is the end, you know? Well, that could have gone better in some ways, but honestly, it could have gone a lot worse. I will combine this with that there. And I guess I'll use that. Yeah, I need to. There you go, all good. No knife run was a success. Oh, there's some ammo over here. I'll take that. Let me scourge this area for supplies before I get out of here. I mean, I guess there's the car keys. Do I really need them now? The car's kind of busted. The car, the key to the car. You must have dropped it when you were attacked. All oh, right, that was my car, wasn't it? So that's why it says the. Okay, that's the car that we began. At. For some reason, I thought it was their car, but no, that is. Uh, that was. Well, there goes my car. Can I just throw away the car key? This car at items cannot be recovered. Ah, I'll keep up in my item box and never use it again. I'm satisfied with doing two runs there and some nice diversity, which is nice. Anything in here? No other supplies that I've already collected. Um, I mean, there might be some hidden items somewhere, but I feel like I got everything, so. We'll go up. Nice motorbike and all that, though. Nice seat. Oh. <laughs> This fucking pole just spooked the hell out of me. <laughs> I can't fucking A. Alright, let's go. There you go. Do I have your attention, boy? You're about to see some wonderful. Oh, fuck! Well, Jack can stare at the back of my car if he really wants to, I guess. Well, that was a fun boss fight, honestly. Oh, this looks cool. There is shotgun shells there. I will certainly take shotgun shells. Anything else here? Things and areas to cross. That looks important. It's missing a head. Oh, it's not on the back. Turn it. Oh, it's gonna let the body loose. Ox structure right there. Then I got a magnificent ox statuette. Can we look at its graceful form here? Yes, I can. The graceful form of the oxen. <laughs> it just starts running on its way. I'm in a silly mood. Oh, I can push this. You know what? I think I will. Push this, I mean. Well, out we go. Where are we going to stop next? I'm going to crawl over this way. Probably drop down there. Yeah, I'm going to drop. Oh, wait, this is outside. Oh, if I had looked up this whole entire. Ah, okay. I know where we are at the very least. Can I open this again? Jack should have a nice nap. As should the police officer. Rest in pieces. Okay. Well, we got everything done here. I think we need to get done. Might be all the little random doohickeys I can mess around with, but this seems pretty good. Open this up. Is there something shining there? I think I just imagined it. Ooh, the saver music kicked in finally. 
favorite music. Let's put some of this stuff away. I don't need these car keys. I could discard them. But I'm just gonna move them in here. It's for memory's sake. Now, I don't have a shotgun, so I don't really need shotgun shells. And now, I'm trying to put some of my healing stuff away. I'll put this away. I will take a first aid med, but I will not take a strong first aid med. Now, I do have all these items like the defense coin and the dirty coin, which all have buffs, and if I need them, I'll use them, but I'm going to try and not use them. I'll save them for Madhouse. I need this. I'll take my handgun bullets. Can I, like, okay, let me try something. Can I do the classic Resident Evil thing where I take these and I'm like, combine and move the gun? No. Oh, but there's something which I can do with them. So you cannot... Muskers, is my gun already fully loaded? That's not. So you cannot combine bullets to forge them out like that. That's good to know at the very least. Make my save game here. I'm also going to make a new save state because I like that boss battle. And I might want to fight it again sometime. Alright. Running and gunning. Nothing else. I think it's about time for us to leave this part of the house on the next, it seems. On our map, if we look at that for a second, it shows that the main hall is right here. Look at that main hall. Oh boy. I think we're good. I'm excited to get to the main hall, so let's do this. Put the ox statue at the male statue that looks like a headless ox right into this. And it opens like a door unlocking mechanism. So it open. And we've reached the main hall. Phone's going off already. Did my daddy give you a hard time? That's your father? He used to be. I'm sorry, but he, he he's a he's dead now. <laughs> you just might be able to pull this off. What? Pull what off? There's something I need you to do, but I can't explain it right now. You may need some sort of keys to do it, but find a way out of the house. Okay. I'll be in touch. Zoe keeping us updated. Well, time to start exploring. This old neck of the house. see outside a little bit there, but we're not there yet. Oh wait, this is the door outside. Okay, well it looks like we need our classic. It looks like three-headed dog, but the heads are missing. Well, let's find the three old dog heads and see how that plays out for us. Anything here in this pile of books? It doesn't seem to be. Do I need the scorpion key? Probably. Start taking a solid look around. Oh, I know where this goes. Clock pendulum. Easy as pie. Over 20 missing in two years. Captain Howell from State Police told reporters they have or started a search for Helen Midkiff. I remember reading Helen's name earlier from that one list of people who are dead or turned and all that. A college student from North Carolina who went traveling in Louisiana. Mrs. Midkiff hasn't been heard of since the night of the 21st. Reports of missing persons in South Louisiana have increased dramatically in the past two years. The majority of those missing are tourists and va or vagrants. At least 20 people are thought to have gone missing so far. Police suspect foul play and believe there may be a connection between the incidents. Plans are in place to step up local in or interrogations and increase personnel to further the investigations. Alyssa Ashcroft, January 19, 2016. Alicia Ashcroft was one of the playable characters from Resident Evil Outbreak. She was the news reporter character that you could play as. So that's a little, like, it's a little reference. Alright. Let's start looking around. What's down here? Nothing there. Cerberus is Ross, the name of the Resident Evil 1 dog enemy, so it's a fun little reference. That's some spoiled damn fruit. I guess that works out okay for me. Wait, chips, Louisiana, Min, LCS. What a brand for chips. Anything under the table? The answer to my question is no. No, there. Oh, it's a destroy Mr. Everything, though. 
1991 Arclay Mountains. That's from Resident Evil 1. Arclay Mountains, July 7th, 1991. Let's pick up the herb and destroy Mr. Everything here. Shoot me, shoot me. Well, I'm not going to waste my bullets on you. Instead, I'm going to... There I go. I am enjoying the game a lot so far, honestly. Let's go inside here, even though we're still pretty early in. Gunpowder. And open this. An antique coin. Another antique coin obtained. I'm going to have to go back to the item box very soon. My inventory is starting to get full. Let's look here. Anything? There was the newspaper I read earlier. Anything under the table? Lights, movies, Ethan. Under the table, cooking life. The life everyone has to spend cooking. All right, let's investigate this. Um, my bullets? That doesn't look like a bird. It's called Sky. It's like Hunter? Hunter, Sky Hunter, it's the U. Well, that didn't work, as I would have liked it to. Nice try. Okay. Can I put my handgun over it? Pow! <laughs> Sorry, I just want to have some fun with it. You still just have to do it at least once, and I'll only point it towards the camera. Do like a James Bond thing if I get the right angle at it. Pow! <laughs> Thought we got messed up a little bit there. Alright, I'm gonna stop messing with that. Okay. Let's oh, back here. More chem fluid. Ooh. Now, unfortunately, with this big old steel door with this mechanism on it, I've got a pretty good idea. I think I know what's about to happen. But I'll dream a little. It's locked. Why am I not surprised? Well, let's put you back. Give me my antique coin. That doesn't fit. Okay, <laughs> I figured. Here you go. Have your shotgun. get you eventually, I'm certain. So before I go upstairs and start exploring, that's over here. I want to go back to the item box and drop off some things. I think I already know what one of the things I picked up is for. I've played enough horror games to have a pretty good sense for these uh, for this stuff, and one of my senses is telling me, Ryan, go... Was that? Was there something? Yeah, that's what the spoons were. Tells me I need to go over here, drop off the clock, Piece here. Aha! We already got one of the dog heads. White dog's head. See, ain't I just genius? Let's open those really tough puzzles. Let's open this one up. Go back to the save room fun. Drop off a few things. I don't need the antique coin for now. Um, gunpowder. Gunpowder that can be packed into bullets, combined into chem fluid to create handgun ammo. So I can make additional handgun ammo if I... Uh, threat, threat, threat. Mix more chemicals with it. I don't really need ammo yet, so I'm going to hold off on that. But stuff in the way. Alright. White dog's head. I need to find the other two dog's head that wanted to take up inventory space in the meantime. I'll keep the herb just in case. All right, let's go on back. I just want more inventory. So, at the moment, so. got a lot of exploring to do, I figure, and I probably want the Zion slots to pick up shit. Let's go check out and head back on out. Now I'll start exploring this old plantation mansion. Go upstairs finally. What do we find upstairs? I don't quite know, to be honest. Painting of a tower, painting of a ship. It's actually just a picture of a ship. Angel statues. Picture in here. That's a kind of creepy picture. 
Evelyn, May 2nd, 2014. So Evelyn is the name of this little girl. This is her in 2014. Oh moy. Nothing there. Now if only I had the snake key. Fortunately, I do not have the snake key, so you know, what am I gonna do about that? That's a creepy picture. Football! <laughs> I'm not really enthusiastic for that. Just all this football stuff here. You think Jack was really big into football? Or do you think it was Marguerite? Could have been Lucas, actually. Well, hey, Grandma's back! Here, I feel like there'd be something stuffed in here, but I don't see nothing. Hi, Grandma. She looks really happy to see us. Really happy to see us. Yeah, this game is set in 2017, as I should mention, which it is, too. In fact, it's it's set in the future, because I think it's set... It's definitely 100% set after July 2017, since that's when the Pete and Clancy and Andre tape is. That sets in, the, like, I think it was July 2017, and since, obviously, that was before this game. This is sometime after that in late 2017, I guess. This is a pretty nifty area. Football? Maybe it's Daddy's hobby. I was actually thinking Lucas, but maybe it is. Also, you just call him Daddy. And I know he welcomed you to the family, son, Ethan. But oh, you can read the book stuff here. Belittle it home. Well, it's a little bit dark. If I turn my brightness up, I try to read it all, but it's kind of nice to say like this. Unnerving combat. There is a book here called Unnerving Combat. Wartime photojournalism. <laughs> I feel like there's a few jokes in here. <laughs> Wartime photojournalism. Fun. They killed him. Creator's rights. Murder in Cleveland. Fearless be or fearless betrayal. Da -da. Discovered wars, you know. Obviously. Home. Sunday romance. So, yeah, I, if it wasn't so, I, I could turn the brightness up just to see that stuff, but it was just kind of interesting. I was just like looking at them. Is that another snake door? Well, that's not creepy. Another snake key. You can use this here, I figured. What's over here first, though? Oh, hey. It's Marguerite. Is she carrying someone? Either she got a ponytail or she's carrying someone. What is she doing? Wondering how she is. It's a lantern, though, but I mean not with her other hand. I think she... Nah, well, I guess she, maybe she's on a weird angle. Well, I was talking about her other hand, obviously, she's carrying a lantern with one. I want to see where, where she disappears, though. I have to see this through. I'm now curious where she ends up. Huh. That's interesting. We've heard of just, just not badly disappearing done. Right. Oh, wait, hey, there's a hidden herb here. I'll take that. Oh, the shiny was an E for the second, but yeah. I... 
Well, that's that. What room is that? Looks like a pretty creepy room. Actually, I can look at my map and figure it out. I'm looking to Grandma's room. Grandma! We'll go there one day, I'm certain. Let's continue. That was a noise. I'll go here in a second. I just want to see what's over here. Another room. I like how you can peek inside the windows. And then just an open foyer. I should probably pull out my knife. And gun ammo. Ooh. Ooh, I should have kept my lock pick. Oh well, I'll find another one. Hopefully. Well, this seems pretty good. Let's. I'm not gonna go that way yet. Sorry, I'm just having fun because I can see how they do the line system. It's probably because I got my lines turned in a certain way, but yeah, yeah. Let's open this up. Thanks for watching the video. I'd very much appreciate if you take a moment to consider donating to my Patreon, where I'm trying to turn this into a livelihood for missed game videos, different higher quality video series for the channel, and my own little games to make from time to time. You can learn more about all of this at the link, which you'll also find in the description below. If you'd like to watch me record my game videos, take part in development streams, or just interact some, I stream quite regularly at my hitbox.tv channel and it's where I record all my gameplay for my Let's Plays. I hope you're having a wonderful day, and until next time, adieu.